Yes, mommy, I'm still here. Yes, I'm going to make it. These are the words no mother wants to hear. But Elsa Ponce says she felt that's what her baby was telling her four days after he was born. Since pregnancy doctors warned her something could be wrong with baby Noah. He just couldn't say anything. And I'm like, no, he's going to make it. He's going to make it. And he was like, his eyes were red. He's like, no, he's not. I don't think he is. The family had hope. Baby Noah Micah Ponce would pull through. On July 28th, at just four days old, Noah passed away. Doctors say underdeveloped lungs contributed to his death. And they took my son from me, but he gave his last breath in my arms. That was... A mom doesn't think that when she gives birth to her baby, she's also going to have him pass in her arms and give his last breath of life. But he did that. And that's the moment that I will always carry with me. But it was her grief that prompted Elsa to do something for other parents who have lost children. She is bringing awareness to National Pregnancy and Infant Loss Remembrance Day, held every October 15th. Monday evening, she will honor her child in hopes she can turn it into a yearly event. Fetuses, they are babies. Embrace that thought. That is what I'm trying to do. I'd like to start some kind of support group. Elsa says it's important that parents get support and hopes their mission to form a group to help parents who have lost children will become a reality.